It's Pablo with ShadesDaddy.com and one question we get asked all the time is what's the difference between the classic Ray-Ban Aviator and the Ray-Ban Cockpit Sunglasses? And as you see here we have them side by side. This is the Ray-Ban 3025 Classic Aviator and this is the Ray-Ban Cockpit Sunglasses. Uh, 3362 and if you're buying a pair of Ray-Ban aviators then you're probably comparing these two and let's point out some of the main differences which um, really make the biggest difference uh, between these two frames is really the lens size they come in and the shape so to start out with the shape as you see the Ray-Ban classic aviator has the teardrop design um, which makes a huge difference in terms of the look of the frame and the cockpit, the 3362, um, is more of a squarish type of aviator. As you see, it's not as uh, what they call teardrop design as an aviator look, but still maintains a aviator style. Uh, the other big difference is the size they come in. Uh, the aviator comes in a 55, 58, and 62, so three different lens sizes, and the cockpit comes in a 56 and 59 millimeter lens size. Uh, the Ray-Ban Classic Aviator is made in Italy. Um, all Ray-Ban RB35 are, are made in Italy, and the cockpit are currently being made in China, so that's a big difference and a deal breaker for a lot of people uh, choosing to buy either style. Um, they both have the same nose pads, uh, same material and all that stuff people ask all the time. Um, that all stays the same. Again, to, just one thing to make clear, while they may be, may, uh, be uh, made in, sorry, in different places, they still have the same exact materials and made of the same thing, which is a metal frame, and the quality is just as good, it's just made in a different place. Another big difference in design of these two is the classic aviator, as you see here, the bridge is a straight bridge, but on the cockpit, it's slanted downward, and I'll zoom that in so you could see here. And as you see on the classic aviator, the top bridge is just a straight bar. And those are pretty much the main differences. If you're watching this video on YouTube, you'll see on the description there's a link which takes you to a blog post where we compare. And if you want to shop, of course, shop for these at ShadesDaddy.com where you'll also see links on the description to do so.